Hi, I'm Tanner with TransWest Truck Trailer RV here in Frederick, Colorado. Today we're going to show you guys a brand new 2023 Logan Coach Riot two horse bumper pull. This is a warm blood trailer, so it's set up as a straight load. It's extra tall, it's got some extra wide stalls, kind of set up for your bigger horses. And by doing that, you get some cool stuff included, like a rear ramp and some cool escape doors and stuff like that. So we'll walk you around this trailer, show you this cool riot. Um, we'll start up here at the front tack room. Your entry door to the front tack room is gonna have your blanket bars mounted on that entry door. They are swivel type blanket bars, so when you have your blankets on there, you can push them over against that door, put some pressure on them, that way they're not falling off while you're traveling. And I like that you can swing them out, get a nice straight shot at putting your blankets on there, because once typically once you get one or two sets on, it's really hard to get that third and fourth on if it's positioned against a wall because it's just too tight. So by making this swivel, it's a really useful for you guys. Down below that, we do have your brush tray spray tray whatever you want to call it against store and fly spray brushes hoof picks stuff like that it's a good little containment area for that and it is drainable so if you do get a you know a fly spray bottle anything like that that freezes breaks cracks leaks it's going to drain out the bottom of that and not get the rest of your stuff nasty up top we do have your sliding type window again i like having a window or an air gap or something on a tack room just because once you get done riding on a long day your saddles are going to be muggy, your blankets are going to be sweaty, and by allowing you to open a window or a roof in or something like that, but in this case a window, it allows you to really air out that tack room and keep your stuff nice and dried and cooled off and keep your tack room from getting muggy. In your front tack room of this trailer, on our back wall here or our short wall of this trailer, we do have your four tier uh, saddle rack. Again, these are adjustable. We throw two saddle racks on because again, it is a two horse, but you can order more if you want four saddle racks. You can reposition those higher or lower, however you need to. Below that, they throw in a nice little jiffy jack for you guys. So it's really easy. You guys get a flat, a blowout, anything like that. You can easily pull up on that, swap your tires, not having to worry about hand crank a little bottle jack. To the right side of that saddle rack, we do have your spare tire to this trailer. And the down low, kind of hard to see to the left, is going to be your battery system and your breakaway system for the breakaway brakes on this trailer. Up high on our partition wall between our tack room and our stall area, we do have all your bridle hooks up high. And then again, it is fully carpeted behind those bridle hooks to kind of protect those bridle hooks and also protect the wall of this trailer from getting scratched up. But another big benefit of doing carpet behind these is that it really deadens that noise for your horses. If you have bridles bouncing back and forth on this wall and get pretty loud pretty quick. So by doing this carpet, it's gonna keep your stuff looking nicer, but it's also gonna make your horses ride comfortable because it is gonna deaden quite a bit of that noise from your bridles on that trailer. Coming down the side, this being a warm blood straight load, we're gonna have an escape door on each side of this trailer. In our escape doors, we do get your big Logan drop windows that are locked, um, but you do get an escape door on each side, so it's really cool. I'll show you guys once we load from the back how easy it'd be to load and offload horses of, on this trailer. But again, you do get an escape door with a big drop on each side. As we keep moving down the side, you'll notice we do get wraparound Dutch windows. So again, that's going to make your upper portion of your rear ramp, both these doors on each side of this trailer. So you can drive with these open, really maximize some airflow. Behind those double Dutches, we have two really big, or on each side you're going to get one big, really big sliding type window. So again, you can open this 50% of the way. If you don't want to have your Dutch windows open and seal it up, you can still get a lot of airflow flowing through these huge sliding type windows. They're probably the biggest sliding type windows I've ever seen. Up above this window, we do have your eight inch LED awning light. Again, really casting some light out here for you guys, whether you be saddling on this side or the other side of the trailer. If you're tightening out feed, and we want to make sure you guys have enough light to be able to see what you're doing. So as we move around to your load side of this trailer, again, your bottom portion of this rear door is this bottom ramp and then you'll have your two wraparound doors that make your top portion of this rear door so again super cool you can run this ramp up and you can travel with it latched just like that with your wraparounds open so you can see just how much airflow your horses are going to be getting but the really cool thing i like about these straight loads is you'll have your horse you can walk them straight in you can tie them take care of them whatever you need to do duck out this front door right here and you don't have to worry about trying to squeeze by that horse you can easily walk on walk off out this door, close them up, and you never have to worry about squeezing by that horse. And then same thing when you're offloading, you can come in really easy through one of these escape doors, untie them, walk them out, and you're never having to worry about trying to squeeze by your horse or trying to get in a bind. 
But up inside this trailer, we'll go over some features that Logan's included on this Riot model. You get your padded dividers both on your divider and your divider wall on each side. You will have LED lighting on each side for both of these stalls. And on top of that, probably the biggest main feature of this trailer is gonna be the flooring. This is their whiz-proof flooring underneath this poly last. So what that is, is this floor is engineered to drain while you're traveling. So it's built on slats that have gaps built into them. And this is a porous permanent rubber on top. So again, any urine, any water, it's gonna drain right through this floor and to the road while you're traveling. You don't have to run shavings if you don't want to, you're more than welcome to. But again, it's gonna keep this area nice and neat for your horses. It's gonna keep that ammonia from building up from that urine. And it's just gonna be a lot easier to maintain and clean for you guys. And each one of these stalls, again, it is a straight load stall, so you will have a butt bar and a chest bar up front. But the other thing I like that's cool about their setups is this moves. So if you have a really big horse and you want to give them some extra room, you can always swivel this over, latch it against that wall, and then you'll have a big kind of slanted stall for your horse. You'll have a lot of room to move around and just be a lot more spacious. So you do have options in this trailer, and it's really cool that you get those options. And then again, super easy to run your bus, your uh, butt bar and chest bars, however you see fit. And it just makes for a really useful setup no matter how you want to do it back here. Whether you're rolling two straight, you're going to want to load one in a bigger stall. And the cool thing is too, the way this is set up is removable. You can pull a pin up front and you can take all this hardware out and just have a wide open trailer. If you just were, wanted a big open trailer with no dividers, you can do that as well. If you come around to your driver's side of this trailer, it's going to look real similar to your passenger side. Again, big wraparound Dutch window in the back, your big sliding type, and then an LED awning light up high. Down low, again, this is a steel wheeled trailer. You're riding on two 3,500 pound Dexter rubber torsion axles, and you'll notice all these tires do have a green cap on them. That means these are nitrogen filled tires. So whether it's a Cimarron or Logan you're buying from us, all our new models are coming from the factory nitrogen filled. The reason we're doing that is because one, we're Colorado, so we have some really cold mornings with some really warm afternoons in the same day. So by doing these nitrogen filled tires, it's gonna really help regulate that PSI in there. It's not gonna contract and expand those tires like you would normally see in a normal air filled tire. So it's gonna help add to the life of those tires. You're not gonna have to worry about flats as much. You're not gonna have to worry about blowouts or anything like that. And then again, here is that other view of that big escape door. So again, loading horses, you can pop out this escape door when you go to offload your horses, you pop in, untie them, and you can back them straight off and never have to worry about trying to squeeze by them, getting hurt, getting pinched up against something. It's really easy to use. So come up to the front, kind of our hardware to finish off this trailer. You are gonna have your Vortex coated V truss right here. You will have your two and five sixteenths coupler, your standard manual jack, safety chains, your seven pin plug, and then again, your breakaway cable that I showed you guys where it's powered by that system in there. So again, it's a really simple trailer when you think about it, but we set it up and add a lot of cool features that make it really user friendly for you. Again, it's 6'10 wide, it's 7'6 tall, so it's really gonna fit those warm blood sized horses and make it really easy for you to unload and offload or situate your horses how you need to be, especially those bigger type horses. But if you're interested in this trailer, the stock number for this trailer is 5N221786. Again, it's the Logan Coach 2023 Riot two horse bumper pull. If you're interested in this trailer, maybe some other trailers we have, or maybe you want to order your own trailer, feel free to give me a call. Again, my name's Tanner here at Trans West Truck Trailer RV in Frederick. Phone number is 303 684 3409. Thanks for tuning in.